Determining wind direction and speed on the E6B is very easy. All you need is your true course, true heading, true airspeed, and ground speed. Now, these questions aren't just for people who do CA. They're also for pilots who may be taking the commercial pilot written. So now we need to determine the wind direction and speed based on the given. We have a true course of 350 degrees, a true heading of 358 degrees, a true airspeed of 95 knots, and a ground speed of 87 knots. So we need to take all of this and put it together in our E6B. The first step is to take our true course of 350 and line that up underneath true index. The second is to slide the back card so that way the wind grommet has a ground speed of 87 knots. That's the little circle above 87 knots. The third step is to take our true heading of 358. So we go to the right eight degrees from 350 because 358 is greater than 350 and mark the X at a true airspeed of 95 knots. So on the 95 line and eight degrees to the right, we make our X and then the final step is to swing that so it marks on the center line and we basically just look above at our true index and get a direction of 052 degrees. And if we wanted to find out the speed, we move our grommet, the wind, so the grommet, the circle up to 100 and then look above that. So that's 15 above 100. So the winds are 052 at 15 knots.